In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to fix faded headlights. They can be fully faded, they can be fully yellow, you can't even see the bulb behind them. These I'm going to be showing you, they're kind of faded up here, they're marred up, but they can be bad where you can't even see behind this. So what you're going to need is some 5,000 sandpaper, 2,000 sandpaper, masking tape, 3M buffing compound, this is what I want to use, some water, just plain water, and then a thing to buff with. So I'm using a palm sander, but you can do this by hand, it'll just be taking a little bit longer. So first, I'm going to show you how to mask. Well, I mean, I, you guys know how to mask, but I'm just going to mask it quick. So I'm going to show you how to do, well, you know how to mask, but you can lift up your hood so you don't have to mask as much. What you're going to do <coughs> is just mask around this so you don't get the paint all marred up. There we go, see? And then we're just gonna go over here. I'll have to get some more tape. But just basically get it so if you get close to the edge, you're not gonna ruin your paint. Which I mean, the car, the paint on my car right here, it's uh, pretty bad, but I'm still just gonna try to save it because there's no point in making it worse. All right, we'll just put some along the bottom here. All right, there we go. Now that it's masked, if your headlight's really bad, you're going to want to start with 2,000. This headlight is the worst one out of all of them, so I'm just going to do one pass of this. But mainly, if your headlights are really bad, you're going to want to do a few passes of 2,000. Then I'm just going to do one good overall pass, and then switch to wet sanding with 5,000. So we're going to do a pass of this. <laughs> So I don't have to do too much of this headlight because it's not that bad, but you're going to want to do a lot of passes if your headlight's super bad. So, and then whenever, if your pad gets really clean, you can just brush it against your pants, get all the stuff of that. But we're going to switch to wet sanding with 5,000 since these are our best. Take your 2,000 pad off, and then grab, uh, here, if I can get it out, grab your disc of 5,000. Sorry, I just keep knocking over my uh, tripod. So what you're gonna do is just kind of get your headlights soaked in water, get the whole thing coated. Then put a little bit on your sandpaper. Then what you're gonna do is just start sanding. <laughs> Make sure you keep it soaked. Some of this, like you can see some of this stuff in here. You can't see on the camera, but it's behind the lens. You might not be able to get it all out, but make sure you just keep it soaked. And I'm gonna do a couple more passes of this. <laughs> <with the buffer. laughs> do is we'll take a uh, dry microfiber cloth, wipe the headlight down, see uh, what you think of it. Um, so I'm probably going to do just a couple more passes of this for wet sanding. Yeah, we'll do a few more passes of this, so I'll just do a couple more and then we'll move to buffing. We'll get it wet again, make sure it's all nice and soaked, soak your uh, 5,000 and then do a couple more passes. <laughs>
think that's pretty good for 5,000. These are some pretty old headlights, so they're not going to be perfect. This is a car from 2008. So get, get all your water dried off of it, whatever you can. Yeah, these headlights are, they're a little bit bad, but they're salvageable. So get it as dry as you can get it. And also, I just want to say, I'm not a pro at this, so if you don't feel comfortable doing this or watching me, because this, I'm not a pro by any means, I'm just a DIYer that ha has a slight clue of what they're doing, so if you don't feel comfortable, you could always take it to somebody that does it. So what you're going to want to do is put a little bit of buffing compound, just a little bit, you don't need too much, and then start out slow, so you don't fling it everywhere, so start out slow, let's get it spread out. Start out slow, get it all spread out, and then you can kind of pick up. Hold on, this battery's dead in this drill, I need to go get a new one quick. Alright, so now we're back, so I'm just going to put a tiny bit more. So get it all nice and spread out. more buffing compound it, it, it might make a mess depending on the color of your car so if you don't so this thing as well make a little bit of a mess Alright, then once you think you're buffed enough, go ahead and wipe off the compound. Which I think this is pretty good. This is pretty decent, so it's got a nice shine to it. And I'll show you the headlight over here. I mean, it looks pretty good because this headlight's newer, but I mean, it's not too bad. It looks. Pretty shiny, it feels nice and smooth, because if you feel this headlight, it feels nice and smooth. I might do one more pass of buffing, and then I think that'll be enough. Let's go ahead and uh, buff it off with your uh, rag. This is just a microfiber towel I'm using. And considering these are like 15 year old headlights, I think these turned out pretty good. So I'm gonna do it on the other headlights. All right, so now that I'm done, it's kind of hard to come across camera, but it's smooth now, it looks nice and shiny. Same with this one, it's smooth and shiny before it was rough. Then I'll go to the back. These were dull, faded, look crappy. Now they're shiny and look smooth. I forgot to get it before. But these are look immaculate now. Before they were they felt rough. They were looked really faded. I'm really happy with this. 15 year old taillights. Look almost brand new now. So then yeah. These reflectors, I was thinking about doing them, but these reflectors are in pretty good condition, so. Yeah, I guess if you guys have any questions at all, let me know if you have any more, want any more video ideas. If you have any video ideas for this car, go ahead.
go ahead and let me know and I'll see you next video.